Hello, this is Griffin Bass with uh, GoMustangSports.com. I'm with uh, field hockey head coach Morgan Bidding after their 4-3 to three win over Virginia Wesleyan. Uh, coach, I uh, came right down to the, to the wire there, but the girls held on. It's three in a row, and you're 3-1 and one on the season. How does it feel to get the win? It was an ugly win, but we found a way to come together today and get a much-needed team win. Um, really proud of Emma Gladstein in her individual performance today. Um, she was awesome out there, and it's funny because it's everything that we focused on in practice with her and in individual sessions the past couple days, and it was nice to see her put all of that out on the field today. Uh, that was my next question about Gladstein. You've been with her since your time at Delaware. Is that four goals today? Is that something you expected coming into uh, today? Or, or any game this season? We really hope um, that we don't have to rely on individuals for, you know, a four goal effort. Um, and even last game, you know, Riley Leakway had both of our goals against McDaniel on corners. And um, I think our focus going into tomorrow, which we're really excited that we have the opportunity to bounce back tomorrow and play our style of hockey and that we can play team hockey, we can share the ball. Um, but Emma did have an incredible individual performance today and we needed her to score those goals and she did. And they were brilliant goals. And it, it was a close game. What kind of things can you take away from a close game like that as you continue this non-conference uh, portion of the schedule? Yeah, I think just learning um, from each game and each quarter and each moment and opportunity. And we weren't proud of our performance today. Um, we really weren't. It wasn't Stevenson Field Hockey. Um, we, you know, just didn't do the things that we preach every single day in practice. And they, you know, all the credit to Virginia Wesleyan, like they stepped on this field today. They had an attitude. They played with that attitude and um, we didn't. So I hope we bring it tomorrow to Cedar Crest. Thanks, Coach. Good luck tomorrow night.